Hi folks, it's Antar, and as promised, I'm back with another new team. Uh, this is a UU singles team, and aside from Glaceon, these are all Pokemon that you've seen before. Um, though originally, I wasn't going to breed any new Pokemon for this team, I was just going to use existing guys. Um, but as I went through the various phases of playtesting and planning, uh, just none of my teams really seemed to work, and I was looking for someone to uh, make everything work. Uh, and that person, uh, for various reasons, turned out to be Glaceon. Anyway, I lead off with Glaceon while he leads off with Raichu, uh, and I end up switching back Glaceon for uh, Steelix, predicting that Raichu's going to uh, use an electric attack. And luckily I was right, and so that was a free switch for me. Um, and so now I'm just going to Earthquake the thing to death. Um, no, that's not true. I'm expecting this guy to switch out, so I use Curse. Uh, Raichu uses Substitute, um, which I really wasn't expecting. Um, so, uh, but, so this is just a no attack turn, um, too bad, uh, <clears throat> and, uh, I'm going to use Earthquake now, uh, I consider Stone Edge because I'm wondering if it's going to Baton Pass out, maybe? I just couldn't see the logic in using, a uh, Substitute, um, because I couldn't imagine that he was going to foresee that I was going to use a support move, uh, but anyway, he uses Surf, which, at first, I didn't think twice about it. Like, oh, Raichu can learn Surf. But then I thought about it some more. It's like, wait, wait, wait. Raichu can learn Surf? And then I realized, no, no, it can't. Pikachu, in events, learns Surf. Um, I'm wondering whether this was a uh, yellow forest Pikachu, and um, I, this, I guess it evolved into a Raichu, and so now it's a surfing Raichu. Um, so I pull back Steelix and send out Glaceon, um, who will take the Surf. Uh, it's not going to be super effective or anything. Um, and Glaceon is a freaking tank, in addition to having amazingly high uh, spec attack. So it absorbs the hit uh, pretty well uh, and can attack back with uh, Ice Beam. I consider using Fake Tears to get its defenses down, um, but I decide against that and use Ice Beam instead. Um, of course, Raichu is faster and gets up another substitute, so effectively Ice Beam only does 25% damage. But um, I'm glad that I didn't choose to use Fake Tears instead. Um, I guess I also considered uh, Wish, thinking that it would do Substitute and uh, just to get recovery, but Glaceon had pretty much full health, so it really wasn't worth it. Um, and it's recovering enough with Leftovers. So now Raichu uh, is pulled back, um, and out goes Vaporeon. Um, but the Smogon Guide is right that there's really not many safe switches in for, uh, for Glaceon. And granted that was a crit, but it did um, an amazing amount of damage and got the freeze, um, which was nice. I love this little Glaceon. Um, its nickname is Kyoko, um, which you'll hopefully see later. Um, unlucky here, so that really wasn't a freeze. That was just a... I thought it was a freeze, but I do get um, some hacks with the Hydro Pump missing. Um, I use Fake Tears to get its defenses down, um, so now my next attack should do as much as the first crit I did, um, and so that Ice Beam should uh, finish K'ing it up, knocking it out. Um, Hydro Pump does a lot of damage against Glaceon. Had it not missed the first time, I think I would have been screwed. Um, but Glaceon uses Ice Beam uh, and takes out Vaporeon on this next turn, and Vaporeon is down. Um, so I've got a little sweep going. Um, I'm up three to one. Oh wait, no, that's not true. I'm sorry. Um, I keep thinking that Raichu was knocked out, but Raichu was switched out. So I've taken out one of his guys, but Raichu's uh, hurting at least. So he sends out Miss Magius. I don't like Miss Magius. Uh, I have serious problems with Miss Magius. Um, oh, and he's also, uh, Miss Magius is also using a substitute. Um, but I'm going to just going to keep ice beaming. I'm not going to fool around here. Um, and, you know, it's going to keep breaking the substitute, and I'm just wondering how long this is going to go before Miss Magius actually decides to attack. Um, the answer, as I find out, find out in a second, <clears throat> excuse me, okay, yeah, so I'm just keeping ice beaming, and anyway, uh, he decides to attack this turn with Curse. Uh, I've actually never seen um, go the ghost version of Curse used um, competitively. I was really surprised by this, but uh, Glaceon still got a fair amount of health, um, so I take it out with Ice Beam, and I'm not particularly concerned right now. Um, yeah, uh, Miss Magius goes down. Um, yeah, I'm not sure why I have problems with Miss Magius. Um, I just, when I see it, I get kind of panicky. 
Um, yeah, Chris is doing a lot of damage, um, but I've got what at least two turns left in me. He sends out Raichu, um, who I think I can take out in one hit. Um, so I go ahead and use Ice Beam. Um, I should back up for a second. Uh, why did I use Ice Beam instead of Hidden Power Fighting against Vaporeon? After all, Hidden Power Fighting um, isn't resisted. Well, the answer is if you do the damage calculation, um, a resisted Ice Beam actually does more damage than a um, non-resisted uh, Hidden Power Fighting, uh, and this is a perfect Hidden Power Fighting with 70 power. Um, and that actually goes the other way. If uh, Hidden Power Fighting is super effective, um, and Ice Beam is just normal effectiveness, it's still more effective. Um, or Ice Beam still does more damage. Um, so just something to keep in mind if you're ever running um, a Glaceon build, um, that Ice Beam is almost always the way to go. Uh, anyway, uh, while I was talking, Glaceon was taken out, um, but not before, uh, I guess, breaking the substitute. And so now Arcanine can finish this match with extreme speed, uh, and Raichu is down. Uh, and the match is over. I really like this new team, especially Glaceon, um, and I'm liking that Arcanine now has a nice place to live. Um, I'm really just liking that this is, this is kind of a team for a lot of people who didn't really work out in other teams. Anyway, comment, rate, subscribe, and challenge. Uh, until next time, so long.